Good afternoon, everyone. Let's move on. We have oh, a studio audience today. We have a studio audience. Old friends, New a lot of oh familiar goodness. faces. We'll beat them. Welcome back, on. family. Thank you. It's good to see everybody. Familiar faces. <laughs> yeah. Joel Despain just said he thought it was Circus Three. Yeah, it is today. Um, and here we are. The last one. Here we are. We've been avoiding this day for a long time. Put it off a week, but it <laughs> didn't snow enough today, so. This One last show. Yeah, it's going to be a good show. We got some news to get to first. So yes. here's what's making news on this Friday. Well, the green and gold is popping up here in California. And you know what? We're going tailgating. Coming up, we'll show you all the fan excitement before tomorrow's big game. Madison Metro bus drivers are still having problems negotiating the snow-covered streets. We'll tell you how it's affecting people who rely on the bus system. Defying frigid temperatures and snow, the nation's largest annual rally against abortion rights is here in full force this election year. I'm Nicole Skanga in Washington with the latest. Let's take a look outside. Kind of wintry out there. Freezing Mark out of a job. <laughs> that's, what, that's what this weather has done. Alex is over in the weather center. <laughs> Thank you, my friend, for those other words. <laughs> and, and I've got the frozen glasses on here, too, today. Yes, bitterly cold temperatures. We've, we're probably getting used to them at this point. we got another polar plunge here that we're going to deal with, with wind chills. It's cold as minus 25 below zero, at least through Sunday morning. Let's see where we're at right now. These are the temperatures outside. These are the actual temperatures, not the feels-like temperatures. 8, 9, 10 degrees if you're lucky. Zooming on out here, let's look and see what are our temperatures across southern Wisconsin. Pretty close to the same, except if you're in Viroqua, you're at a very chilly 3. Wind speeds, why would I put wind speeds in here? The actual temperature with the wind, well, this is what it feels like, okay? Minus 7 in Madison, minus 12 in Viroqua, where they're the chilly spot, minus 9 in Monroe. Let's track these wind chills. Saturday morning, I said 20 to 25 below zero. We'll look at our future track wind chill model here. Minus 21 in Madison when you wake up on Saturday, minus 19 in Janesville, and minus 24 in Mineral Point. So definitely a very cold morning. Again, here we have a wind chill advisory overnight going on into your Saturday morning for much of South Central and Southwestern Wisconsin. But then after the cold, we have other parts of the forecast that we need to focus on. We've got snow coming along with warmer temperatures, but Oh, put that plug in there again, Alex. Channel3000.com slash weather. Click that post your own photo button. We have lots of photos that we can take a look at, folks, here to show the weather. Coming up in Maine weather, Mark and Susan, we will track as we go to the warm. We've got more snow. All about that coming up. And I can watch it out the window. <laughs> I don't have to drive it. <laughs> Alex, thank you. First and four, it's going to be a tense weekend for Packers fans as the team faces the San Francisco Giants in a huge playoff game. Oh, it's so stressful. It is. It's so stressful. Not just fans sitting in their living rooms. There is a big contingent heading to the West Coast. And that's where we find our Brady Mallory tonight. Hi, Brady. <laughs> Hey, listen, I'm not feeling any of the stress. You know why? Because I'm at a restaurant called The Patio, and I'm looking at the menu here. It looks pretty good. Uh, not a cheese curd to be found, but you know what? There is plenty of beer, so that sounds real good for some tailgating. And that's what fans here are doing here tonight. There is a Packer pep rally. They're setting up for it right now. We'll show you that later. So my camera guy, Brian, and I, we went up and down the streets of California looking for fans, and you know what? Boom, Packers fans. Boom, Packers fans. Boom, more Packers fans. These are some friends that I met, Scott and Lori. They drove, they didn't drive, they flew. You flew, that's a good idea. How excited are you for tomorrow? I am extremely excited because this has been a season of no expectations and yet here we are. So go Pack Go. And you got some good seats tomorrow? Yeah, we are in the uh, second uh, section and row 20. We're going to have a great time because there's a lot of Packer fans around us. Who's the bigger fan between you two? Lori. <laughs> you win? <laughs> I win. I did not like football when we were first married, but 41 years later, I'm the bigger fan. All right. Well, we will talk with you later, but enjoy. Uh, I thought you had some curds, but no, they're tater tots, so we'll do. They don't have curds here. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. <laughs> All right, we have more coverage coming up for you, but before... 
I end here. I have two things I want to say. There are two legends I'm celebrating today. One, Dolly Parton. It's her 78th birthday. I had to get that in there. The other legend, Mark. I want to say I am so sorry that I can't be there for your retirement for your last day, but I want you to know how much you mean to everyone you've touched, our viewers and myself included. So thank you so much for sharing the desk with me from time to time, laughing at my lame jokes, and also sharing a friendship. When I get back, we are going to go out for a Mark Teeny. You've earned it, so congratulations. And before I get too sappy, I have a job to do. There's some tailgating going on. So, I'm real busy over here in California. <laughs> it's a commitment. He covered up his hair. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Big things are happening. <laughs> Brady, thanks for the kind words. We're looking forward to your reports. It's the greatest gift you could give us this weekend. Thank you. It's been a week since two of the biggest snowstorms we've seen in a while dumped almost two feet of snow on Madison and our roads are still feeling the impact. But it's not just cars that are slipping all over the place. Metro buses have also been struggling this week. Our Braden Ross checked in with Metro Transit about how they've been dealing with the dicey roads and they are dicey. Braden? Yeah, we've been talking about road conditions all week because they've been impacting you, whether you're on the roads in your own car or on a bus. I talked to one rider today who told me waiting for delayed buses in the cold this week has been brutal, but he understands that the road conditions make it a challenge for buses to get to him as quickly as they normally do. I asked Metro Transit spokesperson Mick Roosh about how they've been dealing with the dicey road conditions. He told me they've been working closely with the streets division to keep up. There are different stop areas that are new for us that uh, there's like over on uh, Watts Road and Junction. It was a place that we don't normally had to direct uh, uh, clearing to and that didn't get uh, plowed right away. We contacted our counterparts over there and we had that taken care of. Roosh told me Metro drivers are well trained to driving conditions like this, but slick roads do inevitably lead to some accidents. But Metro Transit does their best to get people where they need to go, even when that happens. Coming up tonight at 6, hear how he says you can help keep the buses on schedule. All right, Braden, thank you. Abortion rights opponents brave the winter weather in the nation's capital today for the annual March for Life. While they want a victory in the Supreme Court's dismantling of projections under Roe v. Wade, participants say they'll continue to march until a, quote, culture of life is restored across the United States. Several GOP lawmakers turned out to rally after passing two bills this week focusing on unwanted pregnancies and pregnancy centers. Marchers headed past the U.S. Capitol to the Supreme Court. The issue is now playing out on the state level with mixed results ranging from all-out bans in 14 states to losses at the ballot boxes in Ohio, Kansas, and Kentucky. The next year ahead will be in 16 states. We're coming to a state near you, folks. Movement organizers also expect the issue to be a rallying cry for Democrats come November. President Biden's re-election campaign has openly stated support for abortion rights. Vice President Kamala Harris kicks off a Fight for Reproductive Freedoms tour Monday in Wisconsin. Senator Tim Scott of South Carolina will endorse former President Donald Trump tonight at a rally in New Hampshire. That state's primary is just four days away. The South Carolina Republican ended his own run for the presidency in November. Democrats are not allowed to uh, are not allowed to vote to vote in the primary. But sorry about that. But independents are. Trump has complained that the rule is artificially propping up Nikki Haley, but some political analysts say it better reflects who is more electable in November. Stocks were up today, pushing the S&P 500 and the Dow Jones to record closing highs. The Dow was up 395 points. The Nasdaq gained 255, and the S&P 500 rose almost 59 points. Well, could you name all five First Amendment rights? According to a study out of the University of Pennsylvania, only 5% of Americans can do it. One bill in the state legislature is looking to change that. And our Maddie Heimsch is here. She learned more about it today. That's a sobering statistic. <laughs> it is, Susan Mark. The bill under consideration in the assembly would require high school students to take a semester of civics education before graduation. But legislators are divided on how to implement government into the classroom. I spoke with Kate 
Arnold Ullman, co-founder of the Wisconsin Civic Learning Coalition and a former social studies teacher at Middleton High School. She says 75% of Wisconsin students take civics, but teaching it to only a subset of students is counterproductive. One of the challenges that we're facing is rising polarization and incivility. And um, the classroom is a really great opportunity to give students repeated practice in talking to people they disagree with in a structured setting. Currently, the bill is only supported by Republicans in the assembly, but with additional input from the Department of Public Instruction and educators in the state, Allman believes lawmakers can find common ground to create the mandate. Coming up in the next hour at News 3 Now at 5, we'll learn about how one school is a standout in civics education. Well, that's good to you. We will see you at 5, Mandy. Thank you. Thank you. Well, when we come back, it's a News 3 family reunion. A lot of old friends and familiar faces are back in the studio today. We'll take you inside the party. Oh, the news sounds are here. The news are here. That's when Live at Four continues. We often get asked, Is it really free to hire Gruber Law Offices after an accident? The answer is very simple. Yes. We don't get paid until we win your case. It costs you nothing up front to hire Gruber Law Offices. The call, the consultation, all free. You pay nothing until we win your case. It's just that simple. Call us today. Gruber Law Offices. One call, that's all. It's here. Wisconsin's newest and most exclusive sports show. Wisconsin Huddle. It's more than just highlights. It's more than X's and O's. It's a dynamic 30-minute weekly special produced for the die-hard fans of Wisconsin Athletics. Embark on an exclusive journey into the lives of some of UW's top athletes as we offer an inside look into their world. Watch Wisconsin Huddle Friday nights at 6.30. Brought to you by Ho-Chunk Gaming Madison. We believe every baby deserves a healthy start. Yet many parents in our community are struggling to afford the basic necessities. You can help change that. Please donate to the News 3 Now Community Baby Shower. Drop off infant care items at Babies and Beyond, Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Visit channel3000.com for complete details. News 3 Now Community Baby Shower, sponsored by Viridian Homes and Dave Jones. A logo can do more than identify your company. It can connect in meaningful ways, energize your team, and inspire your customers. We're for Imprint, and we know your logo on the right product can create moments that matter. With 30 years of experience and thousands of products to choose from, we guarantee your order will be right the first time, on time, and for a great price. Be certain that the right moments will matter. Explore thousands of promotional products at forimprint.com. For Imprint, for certain. You were always so dedicated. We worked hard to build up the shop, save for college and our retirement. But we got there thanks to our advisor and Vanguard. Now I see who all that hard work was for. It was always for you. Seeing you carry on our legacy, I'm so proud. At Vanguard, you're more than just an investor. You're an owner, setting up the future for the ones you love. That's the value of ownership. Choice Hotels is a family of brands with a hotel for any traveler you want to be. Like number one chef dad cooking up a free hot breakfast for the entire family at a comfort hotel. Mom made this. Um, I added the garnish. Book direct at choicehotels.com. Can your roof handle our Wisconsin winters? If you're tired of repairing leaks and replacing shingles after each storm, call us, the metal experts at Sweeto Metal Roofing. Sweeto Metal Roofing, the last roof you'll ever need. Well, here's a rare sight. All four of us on the set together. It's been a minute. It's kind of like friends. <laughs> it's like a moment in nature that shouldn't be happening. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes. Charlotte actually, and Eric are joining us to help mark this very yeah, special day. Very, very mm -hmm. special day. It's actually in many ways difficult for all of us, but by proclamation, folks, here it is right here. Official proclamation. This is official, very <laughs> official. It is mm -hmm. Mark Kane Day in the city of Madison. And here is a personal message to you, Mark, from Madison Mayor Satya Rhodes-Conway. I'm Satya Rhodes-Conway, and I'm the mayor of Madison, Wisconsin, and it is my honor to present to you a mayoral proclamation, which I will read portions of. Whereas, 
Mark Cain started his career in journalism nearly five decades ago and got his journalism degree from the University of Wisconsin and started at WISC-TV in 1977. And whereas, Mark is known to the viewers of News 3 as the traveler for good reason, he took News 3's Live at 5 and Live at 4 shows to big events like Super Bowls, bowl games, political conventions, and big cities like New York, LA, and Washington, DC. And whereas, Mark also spent years traveling across the Madison viewing area, showing the unique side of Madisonians through his feature series called The Traveler. And whereas, Mark is also an avid animal lover and created what we today recognize as the News Hounds update. And whereas, in a world where information is constantly questioned, Mark Kane has always been a reliable and trustworthy source of journalism for the Madison community. Now, therefore, be it resolved that I, Satya Rhodes Conway, Mayor of Madison, Wisconsin, do hereby proclaim Friday, January 19th, 2024, as Mark Kane Day in the city of Madison. Congratulations, Mark, on a fantastic career, and we wish you all the best in retirement. Oh, Mayor, Mayor, thank that you. is so nice. Is nice. Did nice. you at least get a free cup of coffee or something? I took something. <laughs> I, I've been taking this around to try yeah. and get free stuff. See what you can do with that. No, it's, it's, I, it's, it's, uh -huh. it's, it's my heart. I yes. Mean, thank you very much. Take a deep breath. Mm -hmm. Take a deep breath. Because wait, there's more. There's <laughs> more. Mark, also, uh, oh, before we show you this, mm -hmm. we've been welcoming a lot of familiar faces back mm -hmm. to News 3 today. Keep as you've doing seen all the great the work you For Mark's doing. farewell. I wish I could remember everyone who's worked here. In 46 years. The, the hair. The cake. There's John Carter. Karch, Karcher's Karch. here. Karch. Wife, wife, wife Judy. There's Charles Franklin, who stopped by the studio. Mm -hmm. Garrett, Garrett Marshall. Marshall. Who gave me a traveler whiskey. Nice. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> Hemingway Award yes. lookalike winner. There's Joel Despain, who was a reporter here for a long time. A lot of people remember Joel. Mm -hmm. Great to see him. Madison Police spokesperson. Harvey's here. He drove in. Drove yes, in. Did you get a new he car? Sure no, you guys can still talk cars anytime we you did. want. You know that. We were. Yeah, we have Don, Don Katie. Katie. Longtime photographer. We've had so many amazing people work here through the years. It's great Stan. to see them. Stan Sharsh, an engineer. And Will Loper, of course, who does our Loper report. Uh-oh, there's, there's trouble. Van there's there's trouble. Van Stout. Sports director for about 20 years from the 70s. To you took over from, from him? Uh, Jeff Lenzen between us, okay. and then and then, uh, and then I took over in 97. But Van for many years. And then there's Mark's uh, perm. Again, the hair. Perms were in for a good stretch there, right? Marquette, you're a man of many hairdos. <laughs> it is a hair, a yes. hair expedition. No, it was. Mm -hmm. My friend Jane emailed me yesterday and said, Mark was so good looking. <laughs> what <laughs> happened? <laughs> no, but you were. You really were. It was the hair. It was the yes. hair. Well, Mark also received mm -hmm. another very special honor today. This one came straight from the office of Wisconsin's governor. Well, Tony Evers sent Mark this certificate of commendation for his 46 years of dedicated service to the state. And that's not all. Here is a personal message from the governor wishing Mark an enjoyable and rewarding retirement. Hey there, Mark. Governor Tony Evers here. Congratulations on a job well done and a well-deserved retirement. 46 years. Boy, Mark, that's a long time, even for two young guys like us. There's not many who can beat my four decades in public service. You might be the first. I watch News 3 all the time, and believe me, I don't just say that to all stations. From your days in Little Shoot to graduating from UW-Madison to delivering news live at 4 and 5 to becoming the News 3 traveler, you become a familiar, trusted, and respected face. You've shared the stories of our neighbors putting faces, names, and accomplishments to the folks who are good, do good, and believe in good. And there are so many who, like me, will miss you and your work and coverage. I'm wishing you all the best in your retirement, and may the good you've covered over the last 46 years be paid back to you in retirement tenfold. I wish you all my best in your adventures that lie ahead. Thanks, Mark. Take good care. Thank very you, nice. Governor. Wow. That is very, very nice special. Something. Thank you, Governor. That's very mm -hmm. nice. And Monday... It's the ladies taking over, mm -hmm. Charlotte. So you're going to fill in? I'm going to be filling in, keeping that seat warm. Take good care of it. You know I will. Take care of that chair and take care of her. Always and forever. <laughs>
and you know that's what family does. We're gonna hear from him. It's just gonna, it's gonna seem weird without it him is. here, isn't it? Mm -hmm. No, it is. It yep. Is. We're we're just a short distance from where you live. Yep. Yep. Anytime. A Thank lot you. of familiar you faces guys. showed up to say goodbye today. Let's take another look. You're invited into the party. Yeah, Thank you, Jackie. Jackie. Yeah. And there's Cheryl Schubert and uh. Leah Linshine. Look at the bottle of champagne Yank brought you. Oh my That's goodness, sweet. the now party has arrived. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we'll check in on the party when Live at 4 continues. Parker Heating and Cooling, you can save a whole bunch of money when you buy a furnace. You know what's even better? Saving even more money when you purchase a furnace and an air conditioner at the same time. Parker Heating and Cooling. Your logo can identify your company, inspire your customers, and energize your team. We're 4imprint, and we can help your logo create moments that matter. Explore thousands of promotional products at 4imprint.com. Imprint for certain. This is Kathy. She's about to see her dentist. She's afraid. Not because of the drill, but because of the bill. A big bill. But Kathy doesn't need to be afraid, and neither do you. Thanks to affordable dental insurance from Physicians Mutual Insurance Company. It's easy to get this coverage. Don't believe me? Call or go online for all the details. You could even have this free information kit. This isn't a discount plan or preventive-only coverage. This is real dental insurance. It helps pay for over 400 procedures. That's a lot. I'm talking cleanings, fillings, crowns, bridges, root canals, even dentures. Bottom line, you'll have help paying for routine care and expensive major work. But if you want deductibles, forget it. There aren't any. No annual maximum either. Plus, you can see any dentist you want. Stop fearing the big bill. Start saving at the dentist. Call now or go to sendinfokit.com. Physicians Mutual, Physicians Mutual. Hefty, hefty, hefty. Whoa. How do they get these things to smell so good? Hefty, hefty. Hefty, hefty, hefty. Must be magic. Hefty Ultra Strong with Fabuloso Scent. Family-owned Brothers Maine knows choosing appliances for a remodel or new build can be exciting and overwhelming. Our experienced staff has experienced it all as we've guided thousands of area families through appliance selection. Brothers Maine has a larger inventory and low price deals that consistently beat competitors, including Big Box. You heard me, Big Box can't beat our prices. From sales to install, Brothers Maine does it all. Feel great about your purchases and feel like family at Brothers Maine. Only at Vanguard, you're more than just an investor, you're an owner. That means your priorities are ours too. Our retirement tools and advice can help you leave a legacy for the ones you love. That's the value of ownership. Craig Designs of Stony Hair for Juice. It's keratin, protein, or biotin in reloaded systems. Up to 72 hours first control, 48 hours definition, or 72 hours thicker looking hair. For Juice by Garnier, naturally. At Harker Heating and Cooling, you can save a whole bunch of money when you buy a furnace. You know what's even better? Saving even more money when you purchase a furnace and an air conditioner at the same time. Harker Heating and Cooling. Well, take a look at this. Look at this picture. This is where it all started. Mark, how old are you in this picture? Um, probably 10. Remember how we talked about you used to do newscasts on the porch? Right, and they <laughs> called the police came, shut it down, that, turn I that down. I love that picture. And we have special guests today in person, my husband Dan and the news hounds. It's great for everybody to finally meet you, Dan. Yeah, I exist. <laughs> He's responsible for us having dogs. Yes. That's actually a funny story. You didn't tell him, right? You just came home with one? True. <laughs> came home with SD right. way back when. Yeah. That's the way to do it, I think. I might have to come. <laughs> There's two available <laughs> right here. <laughs> but how are you doing, Ollie? They're being so good with They're all good. the people here. Yeah. And the news hounds, people, I mean, that was the most brilliant idea. That was probably the most popular thing we've done. Yeah, and they're, they're retiring along with us. So. Unfortunately, yeah. yeah. Well, hi, look at that face. Good boy. <laughs> Camera ready. How old is Ollie? Three. And how old is Louie? Six. And they're TV stars. Mm -hmm. And now you can enjoy your well-earned retirement. <laughs> retired from what? I don't but know. People, people just love that. They do. I love and the I, and segment. I, you know, it's just, it's a lot of work. And it's, uh, we're kind of short-staffed now. So I think it's for the best. 
the people you... are going to miss it. They're going to miss you. Well, they're on YouTube. You can look at the old ones. And you can, you walk them all the time and viewers roll down the window oh, and yeah. say, there's the there's new sounds. There's the Here they are. All right. Thank you for coming. Of course. Danny's going to be home quite a bit now. How are you feeling? Fantastic. <laughs> I couldn't be more excited. No, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Let's tell the truth. Oh. <laughs> um, new adventures. New adventures. Yes. New, new adventures. adventures. Right. Thank you for bringing them of today. Of course. Of course. We'll be right back with the weather. I'm Jonathan Lawson, here to tell you about life insurance through the Colonial Pen Program. If you're age 50 to 85 and looking to buy life insurance on a fixed budget, remember the three Ps. The three what? The three Ps. What are the three Ps? The three Ps of life insurance on a fixed budget are price, price, and price. A price you can afford, a price that can't increase, and a price that fits your budget. I'm 54 and was a smoker, but quit. What's my price? You can get coverage for $9.95 a month. I'm 65, retired and take medications. What's my price? Also $9.95 a month. I just turned 80 and I'm on a fixed income. What's my price? $9.95 a month for you two. If you're age 50 to 85, call now about the number one most popular whole life insurance plan available through the Colonial Pen Program. Options start at $9.95 a month. That's less than 35 cents a day. You cannot be turned down because of your health. No medical exam, no health questions. Your acceptance is guaranteed. And this plan has a guaranteed lifetime rate lock, so your rate can never go up for any reason. Options start at $9.95 a month. Plus, you get a 30-day money-back guarantee. So call now for free information, and you'll also get this free beneficiary planner. Use this valuable guide to record your important information and give helpful direction to your loved ones with your final wishes. And it's yours free, just for calling. So call now for free information. Call 1-800-914-3131 for your free information and your free gift. That's 1-800-914-3131. There's no risk or obligation. 1-800-914-3131. Call now. A logo can do more than identify your company. It can connect in meaningful ways, energize your team, and inspire your customers. We're for Imprint, and we know your logo on the right product can create moments that matter. With 30 years of experience and thousands of products to choose from, we guarantee your order will be right the first time, on time, and for a great price. Be certain that the right moments will matter. Explore thousands of promotional products at forimprint.com. For Imprint, for certain. News 3 Now, first warm weather is brought to you by Lazy Boy Home Furnishings and Decor. Discover a shopping and design experience as comfortable as the furniture. Lazy Boy Home Furnishings and Decor. Schedule your free design consultation today. All right there, folks. We've been in bitterly cold times, and we've got bitterly cold times yet ahead of us. Enter the purple glasses here. Wind chills to 25 below through your Sunday morning. So this would be Saturday morning and Sunday morning. Mild next week, but in the beyond the barometer yesterday, I was saying just because it's going to be mild doesn't mean that it's going to necessarily be nice. We're tracking a messy weather system Monday night going on into your Tuesday. Could be looking at freezing rain and a little bit more of that snow out there. All right, alert day conditions number one here. Again, it's that one-two punch, as Gary likes to say here. Wind chills to 25 below zero through your Sunday morning. But at this point, we're starting to get kind of used to that. I got a German Shepherd mix, and we're kind of on a roll with this now. Here, temperatures outside, single digits above zero. 8-9, pretty popular number across all of Dane County here. Zooming on out, let's see if we can find anything else here of difference here. A little bit cooler over southwestern Wisconsin. We got Viroqua at 3 degrees right now. You add the winds in there, doesn't feel like 3 degrees. Feels like minus 11 in Viroqua, minus 7 here in Madison, and minus 5 right now in Janesville. Marching forward, look at the time. Saturday morning, 6 o'clock. I said 20 to 25 below zero wind chills. Future track models saying minus 20 to 25 below zero wind chill. So take it easy out there if you got to be outside tomorrow morning. If you got to take the dog out, in and out. Remember, their pawsies get really, really cold. We got that wind chill advisory here till 9 a.m. over south central Wisconsin for Saturday morning. Would not be surprised to see this again on Sunday morning. Temperature trend, cold, 
warm, 30s. You're thinking, well, 30s, hey, it's going to melt. Everything's going to be great with that. Not necessarily. You got the melting conditions, super cold roads. That melting water goes over those super cold roads and the freezes, so be careful for that. And then here's the second punch. Alert day number two here, looking at light freezing rain changing over to snow as we go on Monday night into your Tuesday. One to four inches of wet snow possible on your Tuesday. Let's track that weather system. Here it comes, 10 o'clock. Look at the, the pinks, the purples, the blues there. And then as we go later into your Tuesday, that weather system exits, but not before delivering anywhere between one, two, three, four inches, maybe an isolated five or six inch amount stretching across, let's say, southwest to northeast Wisconsin, as it looks like now. Seven day forecast, one more alert day after our alert day weekend, and that's Tuesday. Then as we go beyond that, better chances for rain and warmer temperatures as we go out towards the latter part of next week, folks. And before we throw it to break, Mark, I want to say congratulations on your retirement. I know you're over there. I'm a Wisconsin native, grew up in Arena, have watched you my whole life. You're a, a inspiration personally and professionally. Congratulations. We'll be right back. This right here is confidence in a bottle. Not only does it change you on the outside, but something in the inside, knowing that you're looking better. It makes me feel so much more confident than I've ever felt in my life. They are some of the hottest videos on social media. Those videos claiming to instantly get rid of bags under your eyes. Well, today we're going to see one for ourselves and let you be the judge. It's called Plexiderm, and lifestyle expert Annette Figueroa is here to tell us why she says this one is for real. This one is for real, and I'm so excited. We even have a video, and you'll notice the model has bags underneath his eyes and some sagging, and all he uses is a small amount on a clean, dry face, and that's how easy it is. All right, what's the active ingredient? Okay, so it's silicates that are minerals found in shale rock, and what it does is it tightens and lifts the appearance of bags underneath your eyes, and as little as 10 minutes, no prescriptions, and very little effort. Even watching the video, this is a real, uh, it's a model, but it's a real guy with real bags underneath his eyes. My real true opinion is holy words I can't say on camera. <laughs> this is absolutely unbelievable. I mean, I could feel it just lifting my skin. It was amazing. It feels good. It feels great. Looks even better. And I did this to my father. We were at home. So we applied it to his under eye bags. And let me tell you, we were so excited. In under 10 minutes, they visibly disappeared from view. And now it is literally part of both of our daily routines. He calls me every single month saying, hey, Annette, I'm out of Plexiderm, please send me more. And not only does it work on the bags, it works on the appearance of crow's feet, fine lines, and wrinkles. The way you wanna do it is you wanna have a clean, dry face, you use a small amount because it's so powerful. You have high school reunions, you have events you wanna go to, you wanna look years younger, this is it. This new year is the best time to try Plexiderm at our startup price of only $14.95. Your solution is at plexidermtrial.com or call the number on your screen. You were always so dedicated. We worked hard to build up the shop, save for college in our retirement. But we got there thanks to our advisor and Vanguard. Now I see who all that hard work was for. It was always for you. Seeing you carry on our legacy, I'm so proud. At Vanguard, you're more than just an investor. You're an owner, setting up the future for the ones you love. That's the value of ownership. Life in the 608 is all about how you live it, and there's plenty of inspiration. This is just an idea that I rolled with. I'm News 3 Now's Josh Spreider. I'm visiting the people, places, and events that make this area one of a kind. Who's the evil twin? <laughs> Tell me what inspires you, and it might be featured on News 3 Now this morning. My motto is, do the change you want to see in the world. In the 608, weekdays on News 3 Now this morning. It doesn't get any better than this. Hey, Mark, those years of doing the News 3 Traveler Reports and the on-location programs helped keep the station in touch with our audience. They also developed a special bond between you and our viewers, a bond of friendship. I join those viewers in wishing you a happy retirement. Oh, we Tom miss Beard. you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. It's been a lot of years with Tom. Yes, you did. Yeah. Yep. Well, we've been sharing my traveler stories all year, all along, and it's brought back a lot of memories. It certainly has. Can we just keep airing them? I don't own them. You do. <laughs> well, before we say goodbye, here's one last look at the dynamic duo here at News 3 that brought you five decades of The Traveler. Soon 
After graduating from UW-Madison with his journalism degree, Mark quickly established his presence at WISC-TV as a reporter and news anchor. State officials say they can't recall a case like Dotson's ever happened. U.S. drug czar Bob Martinez gives an upbeat assessment. Brent Moss is reportedly hurt and angry over a headline story about... And it wasn't long before he found his niche as co-anchor of Live at Five, which transitioned into Live at Four. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Live at Four on this very busy... Tuesday. But the foundation for his career was feature reporting as the News 3 Traveler. Starting in the mid-1970s, we got to go along for the ride. Mark traveled all over southern Wisconsin, introducing us to a variety of our neighbors who all had a story. Those stories were captured by Mark and his longtime partner, chief photographer Mike Van Susteren. On the road again. Just can't wait to get on the road again. The life I love is making music with my friends. And I can't wait to get on the road again. Mark, a lot longer than you and I have worked together is the guy sitting right next to you. How fun is this to get our chief photographer on the other side of the <laughs> camera? How does very, it feel, Mike? Very, very rare and not too comfortable. <laughs> the two of you worked together to do The Traveler for five decades. Five decades. When did it start and how did it start? I think it's just sort of emerged. It took on a life of its own. We do feature stories because that's sort of what I like to do. And this was modeled sort of after Charles Kuralt and uh, his legendary photographer. Izzy Blackman. He was one of my role models. And Charles Kuralt, obviously one of my role models. Mm -hmm. So he didn't try to copy him, but it was a, certainly a, a base to, go, to work on, a, a goal to achieve. How did you find the stories? I got every little town newspaper in southern Wisconsin, every Thursday, a stack about like that. And I'd go through it, and my hands would be black. <laughs> And it would just be like a picture or something. Well, that would be a great story. You know, they didn't know what they had. So I'd get out the phone books and call them up and say, hi, Mark, and blah, blah, blah. Sure, come on out. <laughs> and here's how we kept track of what we shot. Oh, I... that's your computer database? <laughs> this is it. Oh, look at that. So you wrote down every story you did. Well, here we have motorized tricycle rider. Let's see, new state highway map. Well, that's an exciting story. <laughs> <laughs> World's largest trophy. Yeah, look at those. Look at the cover. You've realized this is sort of like broadcast history. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> there are a lot of characters in our uh, neck of the woods, aren't there? There really are. And a lot of basements. A lot of basements. <laughs> we're in more basements than you can ever imagine. Once we thought we were going to do a feature on basements, how did they build basements? Because we, we should have done this interview in a basement. We did a lot of collectors and... They had the collection in the basement, a lot of collection. The guys. The, the woman always had a nice bedroom that was oh, yeah. all her dolls or whatever right. it was, but the guy was in the basement, <laughs> and he had the shop, and we'd go in and say, here we go, we're going down another basement. <laughs> with, all, with this equipment? Yeah. It's pretty bulky at the time. You carried this. I carried the tape deck to free up Mike so he could just take his pictures, and I held the shotgun microphone to get the sound. I didn't even, I thought that was like a radar gun or something. I had no idea what that I was. I mean, we were a real team. Dance. There's a good picture of us at the boombox parade. Mm -hmm. And we're having fun. We always had fun. And it, it's never work if it's fun. I mean, you've done so many stories. I don't, we've, we're trying to figure out. How many thousands stories? of stories? How many stories do you think you've done? Thousands. And, and three or four good ones. <laughs> <laughs> you had to fill the time. What are some of your favorite ones? My favorite one of all time is a very simple story. It's a, an old man called Buzz Hansen. He'd go visit nursing homes, and he would sing and dance and entertain people. Everybody in the singing mood today. Huh? Okay. Buzz Hansen is working the crowd. Let's get to it. Mark knew when to speak and when not to speak and when the story could just tell itself. He's a real pro at that. And I think that story exemplifies that to a great extent. His faces. It's all about faces, smiles, and it just, it pulls you in. Buzz and Marion strike up an old tune and smiles sweep across the room. This performance turns into a sing-along. How about you? A lot of memorable stories. We did Herman the Worm, Animal world's King famous worm, shot on film. Yes. 
I like worms and worms like me. A dance worms dance. I think the uh, mail delivery girl in Lake Geneva. That was a great story. It had a great ending. There's one other hazard to this mail delivery job that every postal carrier everywhere has to deal with. The hazard we're talking about is running down that pier right now. And as the boat pulls up, you can see the confrontation build. What's that expression? Through rain and sleet and snow? Nowhere does it say mean dog sitting on piers. And the singing farmer. I love the singing farmer. These precious days I'll spend with you. And most recently, I think, that tree, 10 years, <gasps> ten years yeah, ago. That's a recent one. Why do you think you two make such a good team? I think there is communication without saying a word. He knows what I need, I know what he needs. We don't get in each other's way. And I think, I don't want to speak for you, but we're almost putting the stories together while we're shooting them. And he knows how to write to the video. He understands. He sees these pictures and he's clever. He knows how to really take advantage of what the shot is and, and build off of that. So. Very good at that. Thank you. We'd be doing a story and somebody would say something. And I quick look at him to see if he's rolling. <laughs> I got that. And he get, I get a thumb, thumbs up. It's like, okay, we, we got this. Yeah. So you're reading each other's minds and, so. to some extent. After that many years, he just it seems very, very natural. These are the stories that really resonate with people. Um, why do you think today we're not doing this as much? We do feature stories, but they're not a staple of the newscast anymore. I think you probably have to talk to consultants. They want story count. You know, that boom, 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 boom. We don't have time, especially 10 o'clock at night. Who's going to sit down and watch a three-minute story on a worm? <laughs> 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 You're going to bed. But how does it feel after all this time that this is coming to an end? Unreal. A little bittersweet, but... You know, you come to the end of the road every once in a while. It's always been fun. It's it's, been it's, fun. it's not, it was never work. You know. It was fun. And how many miles did we put on? <laughs> we went through a car a year. <laughs> the two of you have some magical gift. People at home may not realize we work in teams. The photographers do the pictures, and the reporters and the anchors do the writing. To have what you guys have had over 50 years. It, it, it's magical. It is magical, yeah. It I, is. Would, I wouldn't trade it for anything. It's been a great journey. Thank, Thank you, partner. My small parting <laughs> gift to you. Thank you. We'll be right back. Get big savings and transform your home with Menard's huge selection of Patriot Lighting. Find your style with over 300 stocked Patriot Lighting interior lights priced under $100. Check out the elegant Josca collection to enhance the style of any room in your home. This two-light flush mount ceiling light is stocked in two finishes, brushed nickel or matte black. Pick one up today for just $44.99 after rebate. Now at Menard's. Save big money at Menard's. Your logo can identify your company, inspire your customers, and energize your team. We're 4imprint, and we can help your logo create moments that matter. Explore thousands of promotional products at 4imprint.com. 4imprint, for certain. There's a reason big dental bills often come as a shock. Because sometimes you don't realize what's not covered until you get the bill. That's why affordable dental insurance from Physicians Mutual is important. It can give you benefits that go beyond what you get from more limited coverage plans. Because no one likes a big dental bill, especially if you're retired or on a fixed income. For a free information kit, call or go online now. 
This isn't some discount plan or prevented only coverage. This is real dental insurance that helps cover over 350 procedures like cleanings, fillings, crowns, bridges, root canals, even dentures at any dentist you want. Dental insurance from Physicians Mutual Insurance Company helps cover preventive care, basic work, and major procedures with no deductibles and no annual maximum. For your free information kit with all the details, call now or visit sendinfokit.com. Physicians Mutual, Physicians Mutual. Five hundred seventy-nine breaths to show them your stuff. Every breath matters. Don't let RSV take your breath away. Protect yourself from RSV with a Brisvo, Pfizer's RSV vaccine. A Brisvo is a vaccine for the prevention of lower respiratory disease from RSV in people 60 years and older. RSV can be serious if you are 60 or older. Having asthma, COPD, diabetes, or heart disease puts you at even higher risk. A Brisvo is not for everyone and may not protect all who receive the vaccine. Don't get a Brisvo if you've had a severe allergic reaction to its ingredients. People with a weakened immune system may have a decreased response to a Brisvo. The most common side effects are tired headache, pain at the injection site, and muscle pain. Ask your pharmacist or doctor about Pfizer's RSV vaccine, Abrisvo. Visit these retailers or find other retailers near you at abrisvo.com. Choice Hotels is a family of brands with a hotel for any traveler you want to be. Like number one chef dad cooking up a free hot breakfast for the entire family at a comfort hotel. Mom made this. Um, I added the garnish. Book direct at choicehotels.com. Well, we've just traced Mark's career as a newscaster and the traveler stories, but boy, you have met hundreds of thousands yeah. of people, mm -hmm. guests on Live at Five and Four. Let's take a look back. Wisconsin's always home Friends who are long remember The family pride we've known Wisconsin people are special people Making this life our own All we are, we are for you We've been here Wow. You were there uh, for uh, much of the, the journey. Uh, yeah. Don't cry. Okay. I've always been afraid of this day because I've always known it was coming, but here we are. It seems a bit unreal because after 46 years of telling you about the good news and the bad news and the unthinkable news, the time has come. It has been a remarkable career, a remarkable job, one that I could only dream about growing up in a small town in northeast Wisconsin, but it was a life I chose, or perhaps 
it shows me. I have loved everything about this job. I've had the honor and privilege of sharing the news with you, reporting on the events that have shaped our world, good, bad, and unthinkable. And now, as this chapter comes to a close, I'm filled with profound gratitude and reflection to all of you who've welcomed me into your homes, allowing me to be a part of your daily lives. I am endlessly thankful. Your trust and support have been the cornerstone of my career, and I consider that to be the privilege that I will carry with me for the rest of my life. But beyond this life, this screen life, there's an incredible team, my esteemed colleagues, whose dedication and unwavering commitment to journalism have been nothing short of inspiring. To them, I owe a debt of gratitude the words cannot fully express, but I'll try. Your professionalism, your pursuit of excellence, your friendship has made this journey unforgettable. And if I can take a moment to express a special thanks to three individuals who have been by my side through thick and thin. My big brother, Steve, who has worked here oh, for 49 years and is sort of the glue that holds us all together. I followed his footsteps into TV news, and he is producing this show right now in the booth. Steve, thank you. To my co-anchor, Susan Simon, my TV wife, your <laughs> unwavering professionalism and friendship have made every day, every broadcast, a joy. Thank you. And finally, my partner in crime for almost five decades, my photographer and friend, Mike Van Susteren, to call him a photographer does not go far enough. His keen eye and dedication to capturing the essence of every Traveler feature story we produced together have been invaluable. To all of you, my heartfelt thanks for your unwavering support and friendship. And as I say goodbye today, I take solace in the thought that it's nice to conclude this chapter on top, surrounded by the unwavering support of our viewers and the incredible team that stands behind me today. Thank you for letting that little boy growing up in Northeast Wisconsin to live out his dream and grow old in Madison. Instead of saying goodbye, I'd rather issue a sincere thank you for the incredible journey we've shared. Your support has been breathtaking. Thank you and may the pursuit of truth and knowledge continue to guide us all. There will be no more See You TV tomorrows for me. So for everyone who's been a part of my last 46 years, I'm Mark Kane with the deepest appreciation and thank you. This is Matt Gunderson. It still hits me every time TAPS is played. We're honored to serve those who served. An eligible veteran's life celebration includes honors recognizing their dedication and selfless service, including uniform and medal displays. A logo can do more than identify your company. It can connect in meaningful ways, energize your team, and inspire your customers. We're for Imprint, and we know your logo on the right product can create moments that matter. With 30 years of experience and thousands of products to choose from, we guarantee your order will be right the first time, on time, and for a great price. Be certain that the right moments will matter. Explore thousands of promotional products at forimprint.com. For Imprint, for certain. Did you know that 53% of your home's heat is lost through the walls and attic? That's why your house is so cold every winter. USA Premium Foam Insulation in your walls keeps the cold air out and your warm air in. Our foam is up to 35% more efficient than traditional insulation, and it gets into places other insulations can't. We've made over 100,000 homes more comfortable. Stop freezing and start saving with USA Insulation. USA Insulation. It's a great time to have RG Heating and Air Conditioning check your home's furnace system for safety and efficiency. RG services all brands and installs quality train equipment to keep your home running smooth year-round. Call RG Heating and AC today. Tip off this basketball season and win up to 25 times your cash with easy-to-play basketball on Prize Picks, the number one daily fantasy sports app. Visit prizepicks.com slash TV for a first deposit match up to $100. Well, look out, Levi's Stadium. The green and gold are coming. I'm Brady Mallory here in Santa Clara, California, and I'm going to go behind the scenes to bring you all of the fan excitement for the Packers 49ers game. Experience the Channel 3000 News app today. Enjoy a website-like layout and swipe through articles without returning to the home screen. Download the Channel 3000 News app, powered by News 3 Now. Stanley. Well, here we are. We've come to the end. Yeah. I made it through the speech. You did, and I was a mess, so I'm glad I was here to hold you up. <laughs> oh, my goodness.
I've been practicing that for three weeks. <laughs> I know. I was supposed to do it last week. Thank you, everyone, for coming. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. We love you. Good luck. Yeah, we'll be around. I, not, I'm not, not going anywhere. I'm not saying goodbye, exactly. I'm not going anywhere. Who knows what the future holds, but uh, it has been an honor. Well, miss you very much. And thank you. I love you. I've learned so much from you. I can't do it either, so we'll just... Thank you. And this one and I will see you on Monday. <laughs> Have a great weekend, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye.